Welcome to the English Maths and Science Faculty. Let's find out a little bit more about the subject. What can I expect from the English lessons at Harrogate High School? In English lessons, we aim to make them all interactive, personalised and fun. We do have a focus on language and particularly on technical accuracy where we try to make sure that all of our students know how to use language correctly, a skill that is useful in life and indeed across all of their other subjects. We concentrate on literature also and we do try to foster a real love of reading for pleasure. We offer our students the opportunity to do accelerated reader at the start of lessons in year 7 and 8 and we also have built into our curriculum offer a larger chance for them to do free reading where we have a wide range of books that they can choose from and read for pleasure in lessons. Added to this of course we have a healthy dose of Shakespeare to enjoy. Tell me about maths at Harrogate High School. We put a lot of emphasis on uh, ability with number um, in the school. We want students to know their basics. We're, we do an awful lot of work in year seven um, on times tables, on addition, subtraction, multiplication, division. Uh, these are the staples of, of the subject and they enable us to then move further on uh, and push forward in, in areas such as fraction, ratio, uh, and also taking those skills into algebra, shape and space, and, uh, and into many of the other areas of maths that, that we cover at the school. Quadratics is a, is a basic staple of, of A-level mathematics um, and then you move from being able to just deal with some higher level algebra into calculus, that's differentiation, differentiation, integration. Um, alongside that we do applied mathematics. Applied mathematics is subjects such as statistics. What type of activities would I complete in science? Well, in science, we try and look at making sense of the real world using scientific concepts. For example, we try lots of hands-on practicals. Um, we will include biology, looking at cells using microscopes. And chemistry, we might make your own indicator to test acids and alkalis. And in physics, using laser beams and mirrors to study light and sound. We hope this has given you a flavour of the English Maths and Science faculty.